please welcome the one, the only, David Nesta, Ziggy Marley. So, Ziggy, you're officially the first guest on my show, named after some rolled up pot. <laughs> uh, true that. Yeah, my older man might have been on a little uh, too much inspiration when he named me that. Uh, word on the street is your new movie is called One Love. Like, I heard a rumor that your religion is the love of money. Is that true? <gasps> no, man, Russ Claude. Money isn't my only religion, you know? I also worship Pon Pon, and my wife and I are Illuminati, that Zionists, Zion, the new Rasta, understand? As my father once said, money can buy life, when especially in Gaza, see, see, see. Interesting mix of beliefs. Now, I read your father, the prophet, passed away when you were just 12, true? I barely knew him, he was, he was always on the road, even living in Germany before he passed. I grew up with a silver spoon, seen. That's why my sister and I made one love, to carry on dad's legacy. Filling those shoes must be a challenge. Do you ever feel like you're living in your father's shadow? No, man. The trust fund showers me with stacks of Skrilla every month. I don't even have to try to be my dad. He said, and I, in this bright future, you can forget your past. But I thought the movie was to honor your father's memory. By the way, interesting choice casting, British actor Kingsley ben Adir as your father. Kingsley had the right name, you know? Dad was short, five foot seven but I liked him taller. Kingsley is six feet one, much better seen. And that British accent is silver and gold. No one understood my dad when he spoke, you know? Who wants subtitles, bumble clot? No one. Uh, that's a wrap for today. Big thanks to today's guest, Ziggy Marley. As Bob Marley once said, Rastaman is not a culture, it's way of life. Respect. Hey, where is the bathroom at? <laughs>